Hey, good morning, everybody. It's uh, Dermot from uh, Spray Foam Insulation Pert, and uh, welcome back to the channel. So, um, just to show you where we are and uh, how the house turned out, uh, I just did that there just for um, basically a little bit of soundproofing or whatever, just as a filler for the, as opposed to putting in fiberglass there. So, uh, as you can see, everything is pretty snug. There's around 125 to 100 and probably 50 mil on the roof there. So achieving an R value of 3.6 to 4.2. So uh, all the walls are done as well. Everything's all trimmed back, ready for the jip rockers to come in. So it's pretty snug all the way around. As you can see there, I keep it pretty tight. I don't like trimming back too much. Guys in Europe actually trim back a good bit and let it expand, but I actually do probably sometimes two to three passes on it, even on open cell, um, just to make it good and tight. So, uh, yeah, so uh, there we have it. We're in the Swan Valley here in Perth in Western Australia. So, uh, Feel free to uh, check us out on uh, sprayfoampart.com.au, um, Instagram, LinkedIn, and uh, Facebook. So, uh, anyway, I'd like to thank uh, the owners here, Fiona and Enos, uh, for the opportunity to come in and spray this house for them. So when we come back, we actually have to get under the floor here and encapsulate the whole building. So, major, major difference to energy efficiency. Uh, they'll have very, very small electric bills, probably zero. Uh, what they have on the roof there probably stop around minimum, probably 20 degrees of radiant heat in the summer. Uh, fantastic for acoustics. So, anyway, thanks for stopping by and have an awesome day and check us out. Thank you.